Hello eBay. Here, here is the uh, Duck Tribute guitar. It's not the Fender. It is just a tribute guitar. Um, we'll go over some specs. I added these aged white knobs. Five-way switch. The volume's getting scratchy. I put that in the ad. The volume's getting scratchy, but works fine. It's a uh, Probably needs cleaned, hit with some contact cleaner or whatever. Um, as you can see, aging is all, from what I can tell, is pretty close to just exceptional. Um, and matching the matching Inve's duck, and then down through the neck, as you see, um, lightly scalloped. Okay, so we got the uh, play loud sticker here. Then we have up here we have the duck sticker, the 1970s Fender decals, and the back obviously is more uh, from like would be from Ingve's belt buckle, and then of course there's the Ferrari sticker, Fender F neck plate. Uh Somebody asked me yesterday what the the pickups are. I do not know 100%. I told him that the tone does lean more towards the DiMarzio um, HS3s over the uh, new Seymour Duncan YJM Furies. Those are a little bit more aggressive. These have more of a uh, mellower tone. Um, you know, so uh, brass nut. Should add that in there. Uh, it's got a fender bridge. It's missing the trim bar. Uh, I've for in the price I have, even the buy it now price, I feel like it's fair for the uh, scratchy pot and the pickups, which I do not know what they are, and for the missing trim bar, uh, all that stuff can be replaced and very easily if you need be so uh, I'm gonna run this through a uh, Marshall MG with the DOD Ingve J Malmsteen 308 preamp overdrive so uh, that's the tone. For a clean tone, turn this. Here. I'm also running this through a, a through a mic, which is going into a, to the computer. But essentially, it's just the uh, Marshall uh, MG, just so I can. Uh, I'm going to play it to Far Beyond the Sun, and I want them coming out of the same speaker, the backing track, and the guitar. So. Uh, you know, it's, you don't have the guitar only in the right ear when you're listening to this. So for the clean sound, got... bridge and the neck so I mean cleans are what you be what you would expect out of a DiMarzio uh, especially in Vegas guitar there are not you know this guitar is meant to be played through distortion with some overdrive and uh, it's meant to rock and shred so we're gonna get to that um, I'm just going to start with the Far Beyond the Sun backing track and um, you know let everyone hear the um, hear how it sounds. It definitely has more of a Rising Force album sound over some of Yngwie's later work, the older DiMarzio's like I said. So uh, I'll let you be the judge and I promised every, everyone out there I would make a video. So uh, here it is, Far Beyond the Sun um, in E flat.
So there you guys go. I just played to the first piano solo here. Uh, as you can see, it, it it sounds really good. Actually, I haven't played it for a little bit. Um, so if you have any more questions, guys, just uh, send me a message. Like I said, I try to get back to you guys as soon as I can. Um, I'm not trying to uh, make a killing off this. I'm just trying to uh, you know make my money back. Uh, the reason I, I played this um, guitar when when we were playing our set list this summer, I played Evil Eye with it, which is one of my favorite Ingve songs, and it did a really great job. Um, the reason I'm selling is, uh, you know, I have I, I have two um, of actual Ingve James Malmsteen Fenders already, and um, this one it, I found myself, you know, uh, just not playing it as much compared to the other ones. And uh, there's a lot of Ingve fans out there, and they, uh, you know, I think someone would appreciate it more than I do, uh, considering you know our, this would be my third Ingve, you know, Strat or Scallop Strat, and no man needs needs that many, um, especially when you got kids and a wife running around. So, <laughs> so uh, yeah, like I said, any other questions, just message me, guys. I try to get back to you as soon as I can. Um, I appreciate you uh, checking it out, and I appreciate. Um, uh, any questions you might have, and I do my best to answer them honestly. One thing, I, the strap's mine. The strap's not going to go. So if you guys uh, are aware of that, then I believe we're good. Like I said, any questions, anything else you want to know about the guitar, any uh, ex other pictures, um, feel free to ask, and I'll do my best to get them to you. And a happy bidding. Thanks, guys.